Turns out the tournament has its own official salon. Hello, for 15 years, a team at Julian Farrell Hair Salon has been, Julian Farrell Salon has been grooming the athletes before mm -hmm. and after they hit the court. Our next guest is a senior stylist with the salon who can talk to us about the hair trends at the U.S. <laughs> Open. Jackson Simmons joins us live this morning. Hello, welcome to New York Living. Thank you Hello. for coming. Hi, Alex. Hi, Marisol. Great to have you. Thank you for having us. First of all, and you have a friend here. This we're is gonna, we're gonna Estella. 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 Darling Estella. We're going to judge Estella. First of all, when we heard that there was a judging station New at the U.S. <laughs> Open, we were like, wow, but it makes sense. Well, it's a little more than a judging station, right? Break it down for us. First of all, the world's media is there watching mm. these guys, and people say, why do tennis players need their hair done? But for that reason, yeah. right? It's become, at this year, in our 15th year, a superstition for them. The men come, they want their, their clipper cuts, their fades. Mm -hmm. Women want ponies, they want braids. They just want that touch and care before they hit the court. Okay. So it gives them a little Did confidence. you say they're superstitious? Some of them actually, yeah. I, they, that, they, that checks. Right? I get it. Right? Because yeah. as an athlete, you probably did yeah, something you with your have, swim cap. Or you did your I, was, I looked this way, and I'm wearing this, and this piece of hair was just like that. And like you yeah. said, the wor the world's media. That's right. It is. And and one of the number one things we do to prep them is we have our our Julian Farrell Hydrate sure. Restore, which is a non foaming shampoo treatment. That gets the job done. Well, we we, sh we sh this is in lieu of shampoo and conditioner. We actually base their scalp with this at, at the sink before we do anything. It, um, it provides hydration that their scalp takes such a beating out there on Could the floor. Could you imagine? They're running around in, they're sweating in under the, the sun. sun. And Jackson, the how long have gets, you been doing this? This is my 11th year at the Open, okay. our 15th year. At so, the you open, so you've been there almost the whole time. Almost, That's right. Yeah. Now, who are some of the athletes that you've gotten to glam up over the course of your tenure? You know, I've, I've seen a lot. Um, I've seen Michael Venus. I've seen... Venus and Serena, oh I've seen, no, I've not glammed them. They come with their own glam, but. Of course. Um, well, you say Djokovic, hello. Yeah, of yeah, course, hello. of course. <laughs> they come and get a manicure. We also do Manny Petty in the salon. Oh, oh. I know, I saw that. Oh, um, hello, look at you. Yeah, oh, there's Bethany Matek Sands, love her. She's she's great. Um, Jacqueline Kako has, has come in quite frequently. Um, yesterday, I had the opportunity to sit with Paula Bedosa. Oh my who, gosh. Wow. I mean, my heart just goes out to her. <laughs> She pulled out, you know, she was supposed to play. Sure, sure, sure. And she's, she's honoring her body. So now, she... now, the riddle is this. They're athletes. They're there on one of the biggest tennis stages in the, the world. world. Yeah. Um, how much time do you have with them? Not a lot. <laughs> not, not a lot. Um, you know, for something like this, I'll just use sure. Estella yeah. here as an example. You know, um, they'll come Estella in. Estella taking center court. Yes. <laughs> Forehand, backhand. You know, she's got 10 minutes to go to get ready, um, and she just needs something quick. So we've devised um, a, an up look that's going to look, it's going to be functional and right. fabulous. I see a little braid going be, around there. Yeah, we, we do, because we dress it up. You know, we do it. By the way, this is two ponytails oh. that we do, because this is not going anywhere, no matter what. We start with one, wow. and we marry the bottom to it, and we wrap it in a braid. So it's it's. Pretty for the camera, but right. it's functional for them. So well, she's for their box, they're jumping swing around that court. Exactly. If you're running, you know, to get a little, you're at the net, and then you got to shimmy back. Right. Look so the that. braid, the pony, are those the two prominent hair trends These you are think big. we're going to be seeing this year? And a lot of times, like let's say she wins, and they have a press junket after right. in the finals, she can come into me. I can be in the wings. I can take this pony. I can wrap it around. And, and make she it has, gorgeous. she has a very like. SJP looking yeah. chignon. Sure. A chignon. I was like, what is that <gasps> fancy pen, word for a bun? You know, what I love there's it. a lot you can do with this pony. Gorgeous. I can braid it and, and make a series of braids oh, and like fold it back on itself. Oh. You can just take a leather cord right. and wrap around. A leather cord. So these simple but functional looks go a long way. And the I girls bet. have really and come to. feel a little bit better you and do. more confident. Right. Because you I, do. I, you don't want to see my hair right after a sweaty workout. It's disgusting. <laughs> Uh, so what are some hair trends you think we're going to be seeing with the men this year? Men are wearing longer hair, for sure. Oh! Really? For sure. And I'm, I'm here seeing, for it. I'm, I'm here for seeing it. a lot of, and when I say longer hair, I'm, I mean like away from the buzz cut, right? Mm. So many athletes have done this buzz, but I'm seeing a lot of the, particularly the European men, sure. but also more American guys are coming in and they're like, it's all scissor cut and it's all mid length. It's oh. like, it's like shaggy, but not below the collar, not over the ears. It tucks behind. A little mullety, I dare say. Oh, well, you know. A like, mullet adjacent, mullet you know? Adjacent. It's not the mullet adjacent. It's a vibe. Oh, it's, it's a vibe. A vibe. Yeah. Now, 
Okay, so when you're 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 glamming up, you're helping, you're you're hairstyling the stars. Like if it's a red carpet, the stylist will awful, often be in the wings, like checking oh, yeah. things out. Do For you sure. do you run out like in between the sets and you're like? <laughs> I, I wish, I wish. <laughs> um, You'll see him right there with the ball boys and girls. <laughs> Move over, ball boy, I gotta, I gotta fix it. But you know what I do to ensure that, like, I, since I can't be there yeah. for that moment, is I make sure their haircut is flawless. Oh, yeah. So a lot of times, even if they're not coming for a haircut, I'll say, can we take five extra minutes? Let me just line up that perimeter of right. your cut and make sure that oh. no matter what she's, which way it's flinging, right. it's gonna come out looking good. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Okay. But he really thinks of everything. He's like, I know you just came this for a braid, but let me, can I just don't cut? Don't be ridiculous. Can I just make, <laughs> this is Julie Carroll. <laughs> make it neat, this make is, it nice. This is, let's you know? don't be ridiculous. Celebrating 15 years. Um, are you able to do a braid? Because we, we, we're saying that braids, we're going to see braids. I would love to do a braid, absolutely. I'm just going to drop this chair down a little bit. Let me it's go like down a little bit. It's like we're at the salon. I know. Look at so this. We can't get these chairs to move up. Ever. How long have we been sitting in these chairs and we don't know how to move them? Jackson comes two seconds. Well, you got to call me next time. It takes a hair stylist to know how to work a chair. So, Estelle, if you'll just hold that for me, darling. So, braids. Thank you. Braids are figuring. Braids are figuring, yes. Yes, Braids are big. And if you just want to take, and you can do. You can do this at home. I'm going to, so easy. Take your pony, take a piece from the underneath, mm -hmm. divide into three, traditional braid. We're not doing anything crazy here. No fishtail, no, nothing not crazy. Not on this one, but oh. you, okay. you can. But I'm gonna do a traditional three-strand braid. Okay. And I'm gonna go down, and I've got uneven lumps. I've got a, a fat, a skinny, and a medium piece, so it's gonna hmm. have a little more interesting texture. You could tell he's a pro, because I do that thinking I'm doing it the right way, but he's doing it deliberately. <laughs> you just didn't know how to section I off the hair the right way. I didn't know how to section off the hair. You and me both, sister. Okay, well, and okay. I get to the, almost the bottom. Oh, I yeah. kind of leave that out. Okay. And I'm gonna oh. pinch, oh. rough it up, and then I wanna pull oh, I love this. some oh. of these strands oh, out. I love this maneuver. Because this is gonna make things... Even more interesting. A texture. little Body more, it's a texture dynamic. story. You know oh, this. It's yeah. a texture story, for sure. And this way, now it's not just a braid, a braid right? This is a little it has something, a little, it's a, plate. a little prayer. Thank you, it's dear. A plot. And you can, from here, we could like bobby <gasps> pin that on, you know. Look at this. It's giving. It is giving. You could. What's her name in the tennis movie? The um, blonde, Kirsten Dunst. Oh, Absolutely. sure. Absolutely. Sure. You could build that existing braid up even more. It's like a little crown on um, her ponytail. Listen, whether you like tennis or not. You likely have hair. Catch me trying to do this for work tomorrow morning she when I arrive. Stay tuned tomorrow. She's going to do this. Look at this. I'm going to have this, this little look, look this. right here. That is a flirty pony. Jackson. And look at the profile it gives. It's gorgeous. That's gorgeous. And it lifts the pony, too. It yeah, lifts the absolutely. pony. It's super flirty. It's a little bit Madonna. It's a little bit Ariana Grande. Oh, too. Yeah. Icons. And Icons all only. U.S. Open. All U.S. Open. All day. Sir, thank Flushing you so much. Mwah. Jackson, Mwah. everybody, pleasure. thank you so much for joining Julian us. Thank you. And congrats on 15 years. 15. Of glamming. May the there be 15 stars. more, if yeah. not.